Hey everyone, Cody from Mac Telecom Networks. In this video, we're going to be looking at traffic management and doing region matching as well as speed limiting within our traffic management rules. This was released in Unify Network 7.2.91, but it's currently only available for the UDM SE at firmware OS version 2.5.x. Right now, we don't have this available for the UDM Pro, but an update should be coming out shortly so we could do it with the pros as well. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. If you'd like to hire me for network consulting, visit www.mactelecomnetworks.com. You can find me on Twitter at MacTelecomN. And if you'd like to support the channel, I have affiliate links down in the description below. For the first rule, we're going to do region matching for this computer not to be able to reach the United States. We could already block out countries in our threat management as well, but this will allow you to do a single PC or a full subnet. We'll just do the single PC. So I'll create a new rule. And then here we have our action. We're going to want to block this computer. And under the category, we're going to want to switch this to region. Under the region, I'm going to select United States. And the reason I'm doing United States, it's just easier for me to find a website to show you guys that this is working. Under the target device, I'm going to select this PC. So I'm going to select the drop down menu and then we'll scroll down. You'd see here that we could select the full subnet if we'd like. And here's my computer at 192.168.10.194. We could also select multiple different devices if we want in different subnets. Just to show you that I could get out to US sites right now, I'll go open up a command prompt and then we'll ping amazon.com. And we could see those ping replies are coming back. Also, if you want to put this just on a schedule, we could do that. We could have it always on every day, every week, one time only, or we could create a custom schedule. You could also put speed limits on, which I'll show you that after, because you only could do that if the action is allow. And now the description will be block PC to USA, and then I'll add the rule. So we could see that the rules take an effect. And if I go back to my command prompt and press up and we try to ping amazon.com, those ping replies won't go out. If we go up to a web browser and go to amazon.com, that's also going to fail. So we know that that rule is working. If we want to pause this traffic rule, all we need to do is click on the pause button and then press pause. And we should be able to reach amazon.com again. And there you go. Next up is the speed limiting. So with our Wi-Fi networks, we've always been able to create bandwidth profiles and we could limit the speed of the Wi-Fi users, but we haven't really been able to do that for our wired users. But with this new traffic management rule, we can. So we could either do it for a single PC or for a full subnet. So I'm gonna create a new rule. The action is gonna to be to allow and the category is gonna be internet. The target again is gonna be this PC, but if you wanna limit a full subnet, you could do that. We could also do the same thing with the schedules and then we wanna have a speed limit and we wanna enable that. So we could see the download bandwidth limit and then the upload bandwidth limit. I'm gonna switch this to megabits per second. And then I'm gonna give this computer 10 by five and the description will be wired bandwidth limit. Okay, before I add this rule, let's do a speed test. And you can see that I'm getting about 600 megabits per second down. Now let's add this rule. Now with the rule added, let's do another speed test. And as you can see from the speed test, the rule is working. We're getting 9.73 down and 4.71 up. This has been a long requested update and I'm glad Ubiquity has brought it to us. That's gonna be it for this video. I really do like that new speed limitation. If you have any questions about this video, please leave it in the comments below. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. All right, thanks.